has been a very tough week for EKU's football team. They've been mourning the loss of one of their teammates. 19-year-old Joey Kramer died in a crash last week in Madison County. WKYT's Garrett Weimer shows us how both teams remembered him. 23 miles separate the football fields of these two Kentucky foes. But at Commonwealth Stadium Saturday night, the in-state rivals stood together to honor a fallen EKU teammate. Joey Kramer had been a colonel only since August, but after his death on Sunday, his fellow players took the field against Kentucky with Kramer's initials not far from their heavy hearts. It's just, it's just a tragic thing, man. Before the game, EKU fans tailgated and had a good time. Go! But the loss of a young defensive lineman, just 19 years old, still wasn't far from their minds. It's unfortunate that a young man like that should pass, but hopefully some good will come out of it. EKU fans told me the tributes go to show what's most important, not just on game day, but every day. You know, we're different teams, but then again, we're all on the same team. I mean, it's just very sad and tragic that, you know, someone that young can lose their life. But it goes to show there's bigger things in football other than this game. There's a lot of things, you know, stories leading up to this game, but just a lot of bigger things in football right now. A reminder that there's more that unites us than what divides us, especially when it's only a couple dozen miles. In Lexington. Garrett Weimer, WKYT. That was a great story from Garrett tonight. EKU players also wore gold shoelaces tonight to help raise awareness of childhood cancer.